Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to Dot Hack Outbreak. It has been quite the hiatus between the last video that I recorded in the series and this one. It's been a whole host of complicated things over the last couple of weeks. Technical difficulties, busy stuff in my offline life. Everything is all sorted out now. So, first things first, I am sporting a sweet new invisible laser crystal sword thing. That is two together. It glows yellow. It also lets us summon Lancey or Koo. Um, I did a tiny little bit of grinding off camera. Um, you will probably be seeing, or probably will have seen the results of- Why, hello? Hello, wise man. Thank you for interrupting me. I forgot that you do that. Um, let me collect my words and put them in order and then spit them out in a way that makes sense. Uh, we were really low level. We were like level 67 or 66? 65 maybe? Like wise man? I don't know. Um, we were low level. This is a level 69 area where we gotta go now. A place that Orca was apparently investigating. So I did a little bit of grinding, ended up with a sweet set of laser swords. Uh, we also ended up with a phoenix fire from data draining an enemy here, uh, or a couple of them. So I, I already had one. We picked up another one. Uh, the last test, we picked up another one of those. I also picked up like five freaking owl crests because I kept data draining the same enemy and getting owl crest instead of getting the rare piece of equipment because all, all or most of the enemies that we're encountering now have really sweet rare gear. Um, but yeah, so I got the two together. It's pretty sweet. We'll be using it a lot between now and the impending boss fight. I'm almost positive that we have a boss fight coming up. Like 95% sure. So let's just kind of blitz through this dungeon and get to that boss. Um, I know which enemies I need to data drain and which ones I don't, roughly. Uh, my data drain skill is also really bad. Yeah, we had a blinking warning and a flaming crotch and all manner of bad things. So I gotta ease up on that a little bit, but I do want to data drain... Uh, this is completely new, so I want to data drain you. Rhinek. Rhinek should make very short work of it. Come on, wise man, do it again. Rhinek. I do want a data drain, whatever that was, but I really need my data infection thing to go away. It's terrifying. Uh, you know what? Also, wouldn't hurt to have another st well water. Uh, wouldn't hurt to have another stack of things to hand over I lost the blazing robes uh, another stack of recovery drinks there we go those sorts of things hand to wise man if we do have the boss fight because all the bosses are really really nasty with their horrible terrible nasty status effects also somebody can heal me here heal me while I'm breaking boxes and things oh. All right. Cathartic. I feel better. I got it out of my system. Uh, don't care. And I do have like a crap ton of summons and oh, dang it. Uh, antidote, curse, restorative, there we go. I have a lot of scrolls and things that we can use to clear out some inventory space, so let's keep that in mind as we go down. That was actually a really easy floor, only one fight. Pretty cool. Let's hope all the floors are like that. 
So far, so good. Oh, another one of you. Do I have anything interesting that we can use against this guy? Uh, scrolls. No. Craig, Yarthkins, Lancior, Craig, and Marrows. Uh, we can summon water just like to get that item out of my inventory. I am going to try and data drain this one. How are we doing? We, well, we're still morning. I don't like that at all. And if we do have a boss, I also really, really, absolutely have to have enough wiggle room with my infection rate to data drain the bombs. Don't forget that. So, you know, that's terrifying. It would suck to go into a boss and be forced into a game over situation because my infection rate was too high. All right, another super easy floor here. Let's check this. You're gonna have a virus core? No, you didn't. Huh. All right, that's good enough. Another blazing robes. I think we just threw one of those away. I'm almost certain that we just did. Like, two minutes ago. Recent enough that I should remember it. Alright. Uh, fairy's orb. Alright, place your bets, everybody. Left or right, which way will lead to the stairs down? You have until this fight is over to figure out the answer. Ooh, Dark Maiden. So first and foremost, you are just going to die. You're going to be, like, insta-gib. Bam! Didn't even get the critical hit. Two and a half thousand damage. Not bad at all. Can I... I think... So if I use a spell that doesn't line up with the elements, like, so I don't insta-kill them, yeah, then we should be able to data drain. I don't know if we've data drained you before. I really want to data drain the big old, like, praying mantis thing. But we're gonna get one of you real quick. Airy robes. Not a super rare item. A good item, not a super rare item. Better than blazing robes. Something that we could give to Elk if we could ever use him in this game, but I don't think we get to use Elk in this game. <laughs> All right, we still can't actually see where the stairs are. I'm gonna go with left. Boy. Everybody do stuff. I'm just going to Lancey or them to death. Wise man do his thing. We'll lance you over this one. Or guns out. Here, we'll just lance you over this one also. Shabam! 5,000 damage. <laughs> I, I love this. The summons are so ridiculously strong. Fire dragon. That's a uh, helmet better than ice dragon. Is it. What does uh, Black Rose have equipped? So we could stand to get better feet and hands for Wise Man. Spirit Dragon. That's really good. I've been holding out this whole time. No. Off of Greaves, level 66. Those are actually better for Wise Man. Wise Man, I'm so sorry. Now that Quite an item. Cool, and then I don't think I had anything better for Black Rose. Yeah, she has a really good helmet. Yeah, we're good. And the verdict? Yep, downstairs. Yeah. It's these things. These things are the worst. Because they can one-shot Black Rose. Okay, everybody go into attack mode. Wise man, first aid. I 
probably need to recovery drink myself. Oh. What else do we have? Tempest Strike, that's all we got. It's pretty good. It's a level three spin like a top maneuver. A little bit of lightning, doesn't really help against this guy, this stair, but... Yeah, these are the things that I data drain the hell out of, and they are really, really, really obnoxious. But it should do a pretty good job of lowering my infection rate. Please. How are we doing? Still bad. Could be worse, could also be better. Ooh, another Star Viking. All right, we got another chance at seeing what he's got. Lining. Give me something fantastic. Let me data drain you. Wise man, don't kill it. Let's maybe say attack so the wise man doesn't kill it. Am I going to kill it? I'm going to end up killing it. Oh, I didn't kill it. Okay. Uh, 21, 28. Give me a rare weapon, please. And then we're just going to be missing one from the witches. Ooh, five stars. We just get a five star weapon. Oh, airy robes are so good. so hard to give up good gear. We'll toss the wolf crest. What did we just get? Ooh, look at that. Ooh, so it's going to be a katana. A fire katana. Replacing the earth katana that Black Rose is using right now. That's really neat. Oh, my abdu's gone. Oh, I'm so slow. Okay, everybody first aid. I need to abdu myself. Abdu! Abdu! <laughs> Black Rose, let's, uh, let's... Oh, hello, first person mode. Let's get a look at your katana that you got going on there. Here, Yeah, pretty cool. Decent. It looks like it's made out of stone, which is kind of a nice effect. And then it, yeah. you can have one of these. Five stars. We have all sorts of weird stuff. Here, have a five stars. You sure I can really have this? I, uh, um, thank you. You are welcome. Oh man, look at that. Oh, I like the, like, shattered effect in the middle. Like, it's all broken, but it's still holding its form. And it's like a laser katana. Is it? Oh, it leaves a red trail. It's like mine leave the uh, the twin gold trails. And it just leaves a red trail. Look at that. It's so cool. <laughs> it's so cool. All right. Uh, treasure. Let's get the F out of Dodge. All right. You know what? Don't care. Don't care. You can just die. Oh, wise man, you missed. That's awful. There we go. Let's get a little uh, fall rep. And let's go grab treasure. I was hoping for a virus core. I'm kind of disappointed. I am disappointed. That's okay. So this was B3. Hopefully B4 is the final floor of this dungeon. Hopefully we get a boss fight right away. Yeah, just like that. There we go. All right. Yeah, it's glowing. So data bug, maybe a phase of the wave. It's very, very slowly creep towards it. Um, let's strengthen. Do we have any of those? I have Abdu. I'll give it Abdu to Black Rose. Wise Man just kind of stands in one spot and does his stuff, so... Yeah, we're good. All right, we're good. The area Sigma, chatting, snaring twins, is now quarantined. Oh, sweet. Communication will be offline. Ready! I love these boss intros. Hey! 
Gore the Machinator. I hate this one. Just who designs these freaky things anyway? Good question. Good question. Alright, let's go nuts. So one of these is immune to physical attacks. One of them is immune to magic attacks. Um, Vulcan kills, you're all going to be attacking the wrong thing. Wise man, you're just going to be first aid. Uh, Black Rose, attack this one. Now, they share a health bar, so like, we don't have to worry about that. It's just going to be a matter of fighting the right one. Oh, and I don't like my infection right here. This might be really bad. I think the one with the blue gem is the one that we want. Yeah, okay. So, yep, just gonna have a lot of this going on. Here, have an antidote, Black Rose. Um, also, because my inventory is a little out of control, let's use a couple of scrolls here against Want to use Green Call? Yeah, we'll use a level 2 Crake Summon against that one. Karake? Did you just say Karake? karake -ku? That's not right. Garthkins, maybe? Yeah. Garthkin Koo. Uh, so many of these things. Yeah, is it Crake? It, I pronounce it Crake. Do you call it Crake? What did you call it? Here, let's listen. Kurake. Kurake? Huh. Oh, creeping murder. <laughs> That's terrifying. Yeah, oh, all of this guy's attacks hit really, really, really hard. Are we we're blue gem? Also, don't stand in the middle of that. That hurts. Everything just hurts. Like all bosses, but more so. Okay, we should be able to Tempest Strike. We can also just, for the hell of it, throw out a Lancior every now and then. Oh, but not when he's doing this nonsense. Bye, wise man. Oh, man. It killed Wise Man in, like, the first two hits, and then just kept going. Oh. Okay. Let's... We're gonna focus on... Oh, my gosh. Knock it off, Gore. You're awful. In the middle of that. Can we... We can't even target them when they're doing that. That's dumb. If we do, like, a wood attack. Oop, 100 damage. Not bad. This is such an obnoxious fight. Oh, data drain? You know... Yes, well, shall we do them? You gotta admit, the bosses have really cool looking attacks. Flare of Conspiracy. He's gonna start data draining soon. There we go. Be gone. Did you hear everything? No, but I did. All right. Problem solved. Let's land see where the other one there. 400 damage. That's not bad. It, I don't think it's worth using, though. That's a lot of SP for, you know, four hits worth of damage. 
Uh oh, get out of there. Alright, everybody just do whatever. Um Wise Man can't designate a target for you yet. Black Rose is gonna make sure that you are attacking the right one, but I can't do that until we're close enough to attack. Here. Black Rose, your target is always going to be the blue one. Wise Man, your target will be that one. And here, have an artisan soul. Have all of your SP back. And now do something, please. Oh boy, he's about to die again. I don't know why I even bothered. Waste of an artisan soul. Oh, is he gonna fall rep himself? Yes. Okay. Vulcan cool. Oh, dang it. Now he's, oh, is this gonna hit all of us? We might be in a world of trouble here. Okay. It looks like a water spell or something, but it's killing our, I mean, it's some sort of physical damage because it's wrecking wise man and it's not doing hardly anything to me. Oh, wrong one. Rose, your target is... We can't set it because we can't attack them. Alright. Oh, creeping murder again. I think... Oh my god. Goodness, that does so much damage. <laughs> this fight is ridiculous. Oh, and my app do wore off. Of course it did. Just to help me stay top off, I think I have a bunch of health charms. Yeah, we have a boatload of these, so let's go ahead and just get that going. Again. Bye, wise man. I'm sorry. Did oh, I need to use a restorative to wake her up? Oops. Come on. Stay out of that. Recovery drink. I just, this is when I really hate the micromanagement that you have to do in this game. Like, I shouldn't have to just spend most of the boss fight in menus trying to heal people and, like, micromanage what they're doing. It's real stupid. Here, do a thing, wise man, please. I think an antidote will cure that. Oh, please don't creep and murder me. You know, oh, even worse. Well, shall we do it then? I feel like we've been doing decent damage, though. Oh, we should. There it is. There it is. That's what I wanted. I'm not going to drain Arc for fear that it might <laughs> double my infection rate. There's a, a chance that this will end in a game over. Because I was stupid on my way down here. But, you know. YOLO and all that, right? Okay, we did not game over. We got a virus core V. <laughs> uh, yep, not gonna data drain anything ever again for the rest of forever. But now everybody can just go nuts. Like, just go ham on these two. 
Oh, and they still hurt. They still hurt real bad. What? He's paralyzed. Okay. Vulcan coup. Also, we're at the point where any sort of AoE will be very, very good to use here. Because if we hit both, then we're doing damage. Like, we're doing double damage, basically. Oh, dang it. And they lost the resistances, so we don't have to worry about those. Can I get both? Can I get both? Can I get both? Yeah, look at that. That's awesome. Oh, yeah, and uh, he can heal now. Or they. Or she. It can heal. And I'm going to just, like, do that as long as you let me get away with it. Come on, everybody do stuff. Don't do stuff right when they're going into a cutscene, but, you know. Otherwise... Go for it. Come on. Don't die. Vulcan Koo. Faroo Rom? Holy moly. That is a pretty strong sounding attack. But not pretty strong sounding enough. Come on, you're almost done. Come on, you're almost done. Oh, not enough SP, are you kidding me? Come on, like one more hit. Oh, there we go. Bam, boss defeated. Times two. Ooh. Hello, you two. And Balmung. All appears to have gone well. An investigation will still be needed, but I guess you've succeeded for now. Let us rejoice at our triumph. Kazu. Hold on, we're nearly there. Theta server. Detecting fluctuation of massive data. The immensity. There's a possibility that it's the cursed wave itself. It's moving. It's running. This marks the beginning of the counterattack. Counterattack? No. We have just realized the true rule of the game. Harold created. There we go, credits. I love how nonsensical that final line from Kite was. Good grief. <laughs> uh, I do love the way these credits go. Okay, um, I'm going to stop talking. You can watch the credits if you enjoy the music or not. Um, we're done with volume three. I'm actually not going to stop talking. I'm going to keep talking. Um, we're done with Volume 3. I still have a couple of uh, bonus videos that we're going to do to, to actually wrap up Volume 3 here. We need to do... Um, I need to just, like, blitz through a bunch of ghost hunting. So I... I don't know how long that's going to take. I forget how far we made it through those. Um, I'll probably just, like, tack that into one of the other videos. Um, so anyway, ghost hunting... Um, at the end of each of the different volumes, you get an email from one of the developers of the game. 
and they tell you about a, a secret bonus location that you can only get into once you've beaten the game. So we're going to do that. In this case, it's going to be dealing with whatever that giant floating eyeball was up in the sky in Sigma server areas. Just periodically, we'd see the giant floating eyeball. We're going to go fight that, or we're going to go inside of it or on top of it or something like that. Try to figure out what's up with that thing. Um, and then, so that'll be a video by itself, I'm sure. And then the last thing that I need to do is that level 70 dungeon where somebody reported seeing Scaith's wand floating around on its own. And that's kind of scary, because we defeated Scaith. It was the first phase of the wave that we defeated, in fact. And so we got to see what's up with that. That'll be a, another fun little side thing. And it's level 70, so it's actually a more difficult dungeon than the one that we just did that had the final boss. So that's cool. Yeah, and then I'm not doing any of the goblin tag stuff still, because I still think it's stupid. Um, I don't really care about running all the optional side dungeons to get the lady gear and the cat gear, the items that we trade for the cat gear. We got the cat boots. That's more than enough. No need to be greedy. Although I do think you get like a, a crazy unique summon if you get the whole set, but eh. I mean, it's all going to be... I mean, everything that we get is going to be completely outdated the instant we kick up Volume 4, but, you know. You know, stuff to do. So yeah, those are my plans. Um, volume 4 dot hack quarantine will be following this series soon-ish? I haven't really decided when yet. But it'll be coming soon. I will definitely start it before the year is over. That is for sure. That's a plan. The year 2015. That's the year I'm recording this. Who knows how crazy far off in the future you are watching this, because YouTube is forever, as everybody knows. I hope you have flying cars. That would be really, really cool. I am. Look at that. That's me. I'm I'm Leos. I'm not really Leos. Ooh, Kubia. I forgot that we fought Kubia. There it is. To be continued. Yeah, thanks for joining me, everybody. Thanks for watching. I will see you in the next video. After we... Lots of images. Yep. Okay. Uh-huh, I get the picture. Yep. Got it. Yep. Okay. And... Data flag. There we go. See you in the next video. May the grace of the Twilight Dragon be with you.